Welcome back. You're still tuned into Business Lunch. Now, the four-day-long Sherpa's track meeting under India's G20 presidency is underway in Kerala. The delegates are holding multilateral discussions on G20's economic and development uh, developmental prior priorities, as well as addressing several gl uh, global contemporary challenges that we've been talking about. So, Ritu Singh is here from the ground to take us through everything that's expected from this meeting. Ritu? The second Sherpa meeting under India's G20 presidency is underway here near the backwaters of Kumarakam in Kerala. It is a four-day meeting which is seeing participation from 120 delegates from G20 countries, nine invitee countries and various regional and international organizations. Uh, they're holding multilateral discussions on various topics including green development, climate finance, the progress on sustainable development goals, women-led development, the role of multilateral institutions and of course digital public infrastructure. The idea is to deliberate on policy approaches and concrete implementations. But more importantly, these Sherpa meetings are going to take forward the deliberations held so far in the previous Sherpa track and the finance ministers and central bank governors meetings earlier this year. And this is going to form the basis of the leaders declaration that is slated to be adopted at the New Delhi summit in September later this year. Uh, now, Amitabh Kant, India's G20 Sherpa, told us yesterday that the work is on track and several multilateral meetings have been held including uh, with delegations from Russia and from China. And he said that uh, they will refuse to let uh, you know, G20 be dominated by political discussions because there are uh, wider implications, there are wider uh, you know, issues to be taken up as far as the emerging markets are concerned, hunger, poverty, uh, the role of multilateral development institutions and so on. And therefore, they're hopeful of reaching a consensus at the end of this four-day meeting. All right. Thanks, Ritu, uh, for getting us all those details. Now, earlier today, the government...